Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to be analyzing a game that was played against two players and their ratings are below 1000. So let's get started and I hope that you find this video to be helpful. I move the pawn to e4 and again this is a good um, um, move because it opens up lines for the queen and the bishop. Pawn goes to e5, good move. Knight to f3, also a good move because it gets the um, knight out toward the center. And then pawn to d6. I think that this is an okay move, but there's some disadvantages um, with this move. First of all, this bishop, um, it can only go to e7. Notice this bishop cannot go to c5 or b4. Um, in this position, I would suggest um, for black to move the knight um, to um, c6. Um, so it protects the pawn and it gets the knight out. If you like watching my videos, I do invite you to subscribe um, to my channel and if you want me to analyze one of your chess games um, please share the game with me and I will be happy to um, analyze the game for my YouTube channel. Donations are greatly appreciated. Okay so going back to the game um, pawn to d6 bishop to d3 this is not a good move, and the reason why is because this pawn on d2, it cannot move. When you get the bishop out, you want to move it um, to c4 or b5. Or the other good move is pawn knight, knight to c3. Knight here, I'm sorry, moving the bishop here is not good because how are you supposed to get this um, d2 pawn to move? It can't. Um, so moving on, um, pawn to c5, so this is a very good um, stretcher, it's strong, and white decides to castle. Okay, interesting. Bishop um, goes to e6, and then white decides to go um, c4. Um, so this pawn is controlling um, the d5 square, so okay. And then pawn goes to d5. Now let's think about this for a second. Is it safe to move the pawn to um, d5? The answer is no, um, because this pawn can just simply just take it, right? And it wouldn't be safe for the bishop or the queen to take the pawn because of this pawn. When you're playing chess, you want to ask if I move here, is it safe? You want to strive to ask that question um, every single move because you don't want to be making silly mistakes. So I consider um, this um, as a silly mistake because um, white is just, I'm sorry, black is just giving away um, free material for no conversation. So white decides to take it, good, and then the bishop decides to go here. Okay, white um, decides to go queen to a4 and it checks the king. If I was in this position, what I would probably do is I would um, probably like move my knight um, to a3 because we still want to focus on getting all the knights and the bishops out but why he decides to go um, queen to a4 it checks the king and then um, black decides to go um, to queen d7 um, to block the check. Why he decides to um, trade queens but that's not the best move. Um, white, this is just assuming a queen trade, but do you see what the best move is for white? Okay, if you, the, okay, so let's just think about this. Notice that the queen and the king, they're all on the same line. So what is white's best move? Okay, the best move is bishop to b5. And then um, notice this bishop is attacking this queen. If knight, if the, if black decides to just, um, but if black moves, if black decides to move the knight, then um, white um can win the queen for a bishop, 
and then um white um will be in a winning position. Okay, um in this position, if the knight decides to move here, then the pawn can just take it, and if pawn takes, then the bishop can go here, and then black is going to um lose the queen because the bishop is pinning the queen to the king. Um, let's go back to what actually happened. So white decided decided to do a queen trade. Um, and then knight goes there. Okay, what happens now? Um, so the knight goes there. Um, that's interesting. Um, in this position, I would probably still move the knight out to c3. Um, or maybe go to bishop to e2. Um, but okay, um, knight h4 was played. Castle. Okay. Um, pawn goes to h5. Okay, I'm so, what am I talking about? Pawn to h3, sorry. It's attacking this bishop. Okay, and then the king goes to b8. How interesting. Um, it's very important to ask, like, what is my opponent attacking? Um, black should really just move the, um, bishop to h5 because you don't want to lose a, um, bishop for a pawn. So, bishop, um to um h5 would be good but the king moved here and then white took the bishop for the pawn a very good move um it's you like when you're playing chess you want to try to take advantage of your opponent's mistakes okay knight goes there it's attacking um all of these pawns and then white decides to move the pawn up okay and then again is it safe for this knight to take the pawn? The answer is no, because the bishop can just take it. If you don't know the value of the pieces, you need to learn how to, um, you need to learn, okay? Pawn is worth one point, the bishop is worth three points, the knight is worth three points, the rook is worth five points, the king is worth the entire game, or I tell my students, one million points, and then the queen is worth um, nine points. Um, it is not, this is not a good trade because again, the knight's worth three points and the pawn is worth one point. Um, bishop takes, that's good. Bishop goes there. Okay, it's attacking the pawn and then white finally moves the pawn to d3. This is a good move because now the bishop is protecting this pawn. Bishop, um, takes pawn again is it safe to take this pawn the answer is no because uh, the bishop can just simply just take the bishop on g5 and that's what white did um so again it's very important to ask if i move here is it safe but um white is doing a good job taking advantage of um his opponent's mistakes so that's good pawn goes there and then he simply moves the bishop back good job and then pawn goes um, to g6, and then um, pawn goes to f4. I think um, if I was in this position, let's get um, this knight out to c3, um, because you want to get all the knights and the bishops out, um, but instead um, he went um, pawn to f4, and then pawn goes here. Okay, and then... Again, um, is it safe for um, this bishop to take this pawn? The answer is no, because this pawn can simply just take it back. Remember, you've got to, like, when you capture a piece, you need to pay attention to the value of the pieces. Um, pawn takes, then knight takes, and then after that, rook goes there. Um, it's attacking the knight. Pawn takes pawn, and this is a good move. Because when the pawn takes, notice this rook, it is protecting this knight. Um, so if the rook does take the knight, then that's not safe because the rook can just take the rook. Okay, knight um, goes there, and then um, pawn goes there, okay. And then rook goes there, and then again, I really think that this pawn should just take this pawn. Um, black is making a lot of mistakes. When the rook goes there, then um, the pawn is still attacking the knight. White does a good job taking advantage of black's mistakes. Pawn takes knight, good. And then rook um, goes there, okay. 
And then finally, white、um, moves the knight to c3. That's good. It's attacking、um, the rook. What happens next? Okay, rook、um, goes to d3. And then I'm going to just ask you a question. If the rook does take this pawn, because it, is, it, it seems safe, but this is actually a poison pawn. If rook takes pawn, then what would white's best move be? Notice that the king and the rook are on the same diagonal, so therefore this bishop can go here, and the bishop is pinning the rook、um, to、um, the king. Okay, so it's a good thing that、um, Black did not capture、um, the spawn. So, rook to d3,、um, it attacks this bishop, okay.、Um, bishop takes pawn, and then、um, rook、um, goes there, it takes the pawn. And then this is a, this is a beautiful move. It, the bishop is、um, attacking the king and the rook at the same time. Notice this knight, it is protecting this bishop. So this is a good move.、Um, king goes there, and then we have a check. I am not too sure why、um, that happened.、Um, in this position, what I would just do is let's just simply just、um, take this rug. Why can't we?、Um, so, I don't, yeah, so you, want, you always want to ask, like, okay, can I safely capture a piece? Yes, let's just take this rug.、Um, knight goes here, it checks the king, and then、um, king goes here, it's attacking、um, the knight and the bishop at the same time. And then the rook goes here.、Um, again, I am not too sure why we did that. If I was in this position, I would simply just、um, take the rook because, again, Um, the rook is worth five points, and then the bishop is worth three points. So, yeah, we want to take、um, a piece that's more valuable than the rook, right?、Um, but okay,、um, rook goes there. Okay, that's interesting. Rook goes there. Okay. And then knight goes here. It's kind of interesting, like, all these pieces are very close to this king right now.、Um, Okay, so Rick、um, goes there. Interesting. Okay,、um, that's interesting. So the Rick、um, goes to C1. I guess the Rick wants to go to、um, C7. How interesting. Okay, so Rick takes. Rick goes there. Okay, so this is so interesting.、Um, look at all of these pieces. It's so interesting. Okay.、Um, What happens next is the king、um, goes there, and then what happens next?、Um, rook checks, okay, how interesting. And then the king has to go to d7.、Um, All these pieces are protected, it's interesting.、Um, rook goes there, it checks the king. Um, king goes there. Okay, that's interesting. Knight goes to、um, c8. This is interesting. Let's see what happens. Rook goes there. Okay, it's checking the king. And then king goes there. Okay. Rook goes there. And then what does white do? And white goes there. And then this is a very beautiful checkmate. The bishop is protecting the rook. Um, the king can't go anywhere, and this king cannot go to、um, these squares because of this rook.、Um, and then this knight is also controlling、um, the e7 square. So I thought that this was a very interesting um, um, game, and I hope that you learned a lot from、um, this game、um, analysis. Um, so, I think as a recap, you want to ask questions such as if I move here, is it safe? And can I safely capture a piece? And then, if pieces are, pieces are on the same line, then you may want to try to、um, find and see if you could do like a skewer or a pen. Okay,、um, so I hope you found value、um, in this video. I hope you like watching my videos. If you would like to support my channel, all you need to do is to go click the support my channel button. On this page, then you can um, um, give a donation.
Um, thanks in advance if you do that. If you like watching my videos, then I also invite you to subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.